Cooper Flag is projected to be the number one overall pick in 2025, and the Duke commit surprised many with the announcement he signed an endorsement deal with New Balance. So Flag joins a New Balance roster that includes Kawhi Leonard, Jamal Murray, DeJounte Murray, Tyrese Maxey, Zach Levine on the NBA side, and Sparks rookie Cameron Brink on the WNBA side. So Flag grew up in Newport, Maine, which is 25 miles away from the New Balance Skohagen Manufacturing Facility, uh, New Balance headquarters in Boston in the New England area for all you familiar. Oh, that's perfect. Uh, yep. That's perfect for him. And as a kid, his mom would take him and his brother to the New Balance annual tent sale to buy the family their one pair of shoes and backpack for the school year. So they got New Balance shoes and New Balance backpack for the school year. So Flag will still likely have to wear Nike for games and practice while hooping at Duke, but will still appear in New Balance ads, including the one that dropped on Monday with his announcement. So good move for Cooper Flag to sign with New Balance. Hell yeah, being from there, being from Boston, right? Uh, he's from Maine, I mean, but Maine? in the yeah. New England area. Hell yeah. They all eat clam chowder. It was surprising. I thought he was definitely going to go Nike, but yeah. Um, but now that I know where he's from, yeah, no, it per makes perfect sense. I mean, they don't really have a face anymore. They tried to with what, Kawhi Leonard and who, who else was over there? They got uh, Jamal Murray, DeJounte yeah. Murray. Oh, yeah. yeah. Zach so, Levine is in the New Balance. Zach family. Harlow. Yeah, so for him. Yeah, so for that, yeah. I'm rolling. I want to say congratulations on the new deal. Um, you know, just signing a deal and, you know, getting under a company, but um, the face of something, unfortunately, um, your shoe company matters. Right, there's, uh, there's only been a few people in the history of the game that's outplayed and still became a superstar worldwide in something other than a Nike or shit, even an Adidas. Adidas or Converse even back in the day. <clears throat> I mean, con um, we were talking about yeah, new generation. Yeah. We were talking about since Michael Jordan. Okay. Right, you know, Converse was popping before Mike came to the scene. Okay. Um, Ah, man, because I, I, without saying it, did, because when people's like, oh, I'm surprised he didn't sign with Nike. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. Unfortunately, Nike must see something that they didn't, because there's no way Nike, when Nike's coming, Nike's coming. They don't not. That's a fact. Right? If they That's wanted fact. Cooper Flag, there was nothing New Balance was going to do to keep Cooper Flag from signing. They will throw a bag at you that's unreal if they think you are going to be a part of their future. Yeah. So, unfortunately, he falls under the same category that Jokic fell under, that Embiid fell under, that any big man falls under, that Nike doesn't touch those big guys like that. <coughs> like Nike just don't fuck with white people like uh -oh. that. What? Right? What? White athletes, right, when it comes to basketball. Okay. Right. Not at all the rest of the, the sports. But I'm saying for Cooper, it makes sense. It made perfect sense. Who wore new balances white in our society? White people. That was very, 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 very popular. White people. Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs wore new balances. Yeah. Right? He had his own little market, right? It's called Apple. Yeah. Cooper Flag is here in the market that's in need of some type of diversity especially in the sports realm. Kawhi wasn't really that polarizing. Cooper got a nice personality. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's college, so he get to test the, he get to test the waters yeah. in college. Yeah, they testing it right now. Yeah. <clears throat> and then you look at Maine. You talking about Maine? New Balance? A New Balance uh, walking shoe? My question to y'all is the why, are, why biggest, aren't athletes the... trying to, to create their own shoe? You said what? Why aren't athletes creating their own shoe brand? Well, you got to come up with a name first and, and then a brand. That's not hard. Yes, it is. No, it's not. You don't have the capital. Why not? Is it the, the fear for marketing and promotion? What you have to start your own shoe label when you first come into the NBA? I'm not talking about when you first come into it. I'm talking about just in general, all the athletes that we have now, KD, Kyrie, even Brian. Why is Brian not branched away from Nike and started his own shoe where he makes the shoe? It's the LeBron shoe. It's no longer Nike. Why, why are we stuck under the brands? Where's the entrepreneur? Because Clay, Clay went away and went to Anta, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. 
Mm -hmm. And he was able to create his own shoe, but he's still in the answer. Yep. Lemon Daddy, he created his own little With shoe. Bigger under believe. somebody else? Right, under well, somebody got... else. So Kyrie could have done it, decided to go with a brand. Because, because, so at like, the end of the, because at the end of the day, the funding still comes from when you're trying to talk about funding, you're still talking about the same company. Like when you're talking about generating enough money to create your own shoe, you have to get outside funding. Fundraise. Now, you who's going to fund, raise. Who's gonna fund against Nike, Adidas, and all these guys for you to be able to well, push your... We watch what happened to Big Ball. Angel right? investors. Well, well, yeah, I'm about we, to say, yeah. Angel we all, we all, yeah, yeah, but again, who's going to go against? Because at the end of the day, when you're trying to push your shoe somewhere, the same companies is coming in and like, no, no, no. You want to put it in Foot Locker? No, no, no. Well, the only oh. reason you want you want Amazon to cut? No, no, no. You sell it from my website. Well, the only reason why Baller Brand. You sell it brand. from your website, then you're, you're, you're boxed in anyway then. The only reason why Baller Brand didn't take off is because the, the son didn't sign. Right. He signed with a Puma. If he signs with them, they, they go up. Off. Facts. Yeah, it, I, yeah, it does because it's him. It's, it's him. It's Mellow Ball. Yeah. You need so, the money so, for it. You don't have the so, money for it. Where you get the... That's what I'm saying. That, just, you, want, you need the distribution and you need right, the quality of the product for sure, right. that you're putting out to market. You get a hint. That's right. what I'm saying. That was the issue with the big baller brand stuff, the ZO2s, which a lot of people still that, say why Alonzo had... It was a cheaper yeah, version right. because but, they didn't have the money. But that's what, they, but they go the fundraise. Mellow. You go fundraise and you say, this is, this is our pre-order market. We already got these orders ready to go. We already have a demand for the product. We just need the money to make the product. The same people that want to invest in my career, you can invest in this too, then. Facts. That, that's how I'm looking at it. See, if you're going to give me money and talking about, okay, well, you know, you're going to do in your career for your... All right, well, then this is, uh, this is else what I want too, then. But like this, if it was that like, easy, then they would have already tried it. Jordan would have did it already. Have they there's thought a, about it? They wasn't yeah. thinking about it back then. I but, don't think nobody's thinking about it. But the Ball Brothers were. And it, people it, are stupid. I mean, you think these athletes are stupid? You think Michael Jordan didn't think about, I can build my own, I am Michael Jordan? No, not but he back stuck then. himself now. into the contract. Oh, but yeah, yeah, he yeah, stuck, now, his, but, he uh, stuck but into he the deal. The deal was a lifetime Tiger got deal. Out. No, he did a lifetime that? deal. Tiger got out and did his own thing. He just signed a new deal. He did a lifetime deal early on. Whatever Tiger deal is, Nike has a hand on it. So oh, he's done. He's he's done with Nike. He has his own. Tiger he has his Woods own brand. Tiger. It's yeah, his Tiger Woods brand. I guarantee you, when you start going behind the scenes, Nike is helping fund it. Nah. So let's get back to this Cooper flag. So I think there were some reports that Flag was interested in getting a signature shoe. Would have been a lot harder to do with Nike. But we talk about Caitlin Clark. Obviously signed her huge Nike deal. Should have a shoe coming on the way. But does New Balance now give him opportunity? To not necessarily, like you say, saying, Rashad, it created his own lane, but through a company that, obviously, they got Kawhi shoes, but isn't as, as big on the market as some of these other yeah. spots. And they got flexibility with their budgets, with him making a, uh, not only a signature shoe, but a whole campaign behind it. Hometown kid. Yeah, hometown. The commercial was fire. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, they only going to build on it. And people who wear their shoes are predominantly white. So no, it's like it's cap. For sure. The biggest market that sells New Balance is DC, black kids. That's, yeah, the DC, biggest, yeah, yeah. that's the biggest market yeah. of I, I, New Balance is the D.C. market. Did we ask Rich why he did the New Balance deal? But they do have... Did we ask Rich why he decided to go with them and not Nike? Because he's, he's in with Lynn and George and all of them. So just think about it. Cooper Flag going to have everybody in D.C. black wearing it. They gonna, they gonna, plays they gonna well at Duke. It plays they plays well at Duke. It's up. It's they up. definitely going to have a... It up. plays well at Duke in some Nikes. <laughs> no, I'm saying if he's got this deal on what his back and he plays well, what I'm it's only gonna go. But well. what I'm saying, he's gonna be he's gonna be performing in Nikes yes, at right. Duke, that's right? Cool. And then when he comes to the NBA, he's gonna have his shoe. But for the larger picture of it, it's it he falls under the same category that every big man falls under. Think about Nike. Think about who Nike. Has. The only big that they do have that they push you is Giannis. And look at his game. Yeah. So the fact that his game plays like a guard, and it's like, doesn't Cooper Flag play like kind of like a guard? Why didn't you sign him? What about Wim Wimby? Wimby. Yeah, I was about to say Wimby. Wimby. About to but say. that's what I'm saying. So Wimby's, Wimby's an anomaly, though. Yeah, but, and it's like, well, Cooper, all you had to do was give you a signature. So they had no plans for him in their future. Because why? It's oversaturated. Nike as a company is oversaturated with talent. It's hard no, to push. No, They have oh. too many players. Who? Yes. Nike. No, they... Well, so Nike has too many guys. Nike does... Yeah, but not what? signature. Nike, but Nike, not signature guys. Nike but you're does, bringing in a young guy that, just, that wants that. He hasn't earned it yet. So you can't just give it to him over the guys yeah, you, you already got. You do what you do. You do what everybody else do. 
I'm just going to sign you so they can't use you. Yeah. I don't want the competition. So why would I do that? Why would I sign with Nike if that's what you're going to do to me? They didn't even offer. I'm not even offering you, an, a, that's what I'm saying. I'm not even offering you a signature shoe. That, that tells you, that tells you right there. Like, they wasn't planning on giving him a, uh, wasn't because they're, they're used to yeah. what, guard play. What guy? I guarantee have, you, whoever the number two, three pick is will be under Nike. What guy have they given a signature, signature shoe out of high school? LeBron James. One, right? One. LeBron. LeBron. Um, That's it. I think Antoine. No, Antoine didn't. No, not who? even. Um, I'm thinking T-Mac, but it wasn't T-Mac. No. He's neither one of them. It was just LeBron. LeBron. LeBron's the only one. Uh, out of high, I mean, there's not a lot of high school. C uh, Kobe was with Adidas first. Yeah. And he didn't sign that deal while he was um, in Kevin Garnett. With who, and one? No, he was with Nike. Coming out? Mm-hmm. High school? Yep. His best shoe was the, the, you remember the one with the blue, like it had like a little wing on it? But that wasn't out of high school. But that was his shoe? Yeah. Garnett had some fire. The bubble on the some, back. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. I know what shoe you're talking about. Yeah, I know what shoe you're talking about. But I didn't know but, that was his but, signature but just, shoe. But, but, but again, it's, it's the big man thing. They don't think big man can sell shoes. It's like I, I, I was for sure number one pick, and he's supposed to be a generational guy. Nike, that's all Nike. But he not number one pick yet. Projected. Projected That's to be why I say one if pick. he plays good at Duke, yeah. boom, boom, boom. We don't know what he going to do. Uh, well, That's an investment that they're making. It's, it's a risky it's, one. It's definitely a risk. But it's easy for Puma because it's all upside for you. But usually Nike just, they just sign everybody and just put them under an umbrella and just see. Right. But as an athlete, I'm, I'm not, that's not enticing to me. I'm not trying to be under the umbrella. If I can potentially have my own shit, nah, fuck that umbrella. Y'all all under the slave contract. Y'all got to do, like uh, LeVar was saying, Y'all, uh, PG had a shoe. He was like, PG has to accept whatever design that they give him. That's a fact. That's a fact. You can't go in and say, I want my shoe like this. They come to you and that's say, these are the little, these are the three options we came up with. Which mm -hmm. one you want? Yep, that's a fact. Pick one. I heard KD say that. That's a fact. Like, right. they ain't got no say-so on what they... What you, I mean, you do. Huh? You do. Oh, oh, for the most part, not. In I mean, you don't have a full design of. I mean, nigga, that, you can't say I want to. I want my shoe to look like this, feel like this, all this. Yeah, you no. got no. You got no yeah. creative control. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Yeah. You know, they're just walking. You got to sign it. No. You got to sign a deal for. The, I mean, you got to put that in your contract. That's yeah. the point. That's what I'm saying. So, so you so that's put, why I think that, that Cooper didn't go with Nike because they're not they, giving him but they no offer, control at all. But they didn't offer him like that. That's what I'm saying. Think of think like even with the Boozer, Boozer, right? His game will be the same thing. Like they gonna sit there and like, uh, right? Yeah. They need that. They, it's the guard. That guard moves the product, man. Yeah. No, that's a fact. You know what I mean? Like it's like it's like it, with the two brothers. The older brother would be he gonna he gonna sign if he signs a Nike deal. It's gonna be just we gonna just sign like so party, the other yeah. competition. Yeah. Like other than that, he's gonna be with Adidas, Puma, whatever. The younger brother, a guard. Most likely was signed for a Nike. Di but what? But what bigs have thrived under any shoe company? <laughs> that's, that's what I said. It's Patrick. Nobody. No, that, that, but that's what I said. Like when you yeah, think about Jokic, people don't realize Jokic don't have a Nike deal. He's with 305. He's with 304. Yeah. He's with the hoes. <laughs> 304. What, what he's with? 360. 9210. He sounds like yeah, Area Code. 360. Like he's with 360. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. Nobody getting, or 361. 361, yeah, that's 361 that. degrees. Yeah. Uh, who is that? I don't know. I don't know either. Ain't nobody getting robbed. Is that an Asian <laughs> company? <laughs> huh? That's, a got these that's, that's an Asian company, right? Mm, I think it's, I, I don't want to say it. I don't know, yeah, I don't know. I don't want to say it. So, question for you guys.